Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020-2021 Panini Prism Basketball 2 box, random team break number 19. Everyone gets two random teams in the NBA, no vet commons ship. Big thanks to Brad, Brian, and Blair. We got three Bs in the break. Brad, Brian, and Blair in on the action. So let's double your names up. Thanks to you three for getting in. All 30 teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Two and a two for the hard way. One, two, three, and four. After four, we got Blair down to Blair. For the hard way for the teams. One, two, three, and four. Trailblazers down to the Timberwolves, who were just purchased by uh, A-Rod and his billionaire buddy. But he's the face, I would imagine. I think they'll officially have ownership within a couple of years. All right. Uh, well, Blair has everything except for the Warriors. So James Weissman opportunities for Brad. There's Brian O with the Pacers. Brad with the Hawks, and oh, there's Brian again with the Wizards right there. Blair has everything else. Yeah, she did indeed get the uh, the Hornets, so that gamble paid off. And the Timberwolves, too, for that matter. All right, so let's sort this by column B by team. Let's see if there's going to be any trades. While, people are, uh, while these three are considering trades, let's pop open... Let's bring that full case over here. There it is, Prison Basketball. Is it the current edition? Yes. And let's see which two we're going to do. Yes, DJ, yes. That, that Fleer does have the code. I don't know if as might have Jordan in it. I'll have to look at the checklist, but there could be some Jordan cards in there too. So I'm going to shave some two off the top right here. All right, so we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six on the dice roll. And I'm going to choose that die right there. And it's going to be five. One, two, three, four, five. So we're going to do this stack of two right here. This we will save for next time. So let's mark these. Pick your team. Fun break to do tonight, that Fleer. Although, DJ, it's just me the next two days, so probably want to wait. Oh, why am I writing pick your team on here? Come on, Joe. Losing my mind. All right, Jim Nance, I'll see you tomorrow, too. And this, these two, the top right here. Yeah, I, I'm, I will be here tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen. But I'm off Monday and Tuesday. All 
right. Alright, looks like no trade, so let's just close the trade window and let's roll. Good luck. Oh, there you go. TJ's got the inside scoop on that, Brandon. I don't know how they handle their eBay, though, Brandon, but uh, but the, the organization themselves has been around for a while. They seem to be pretty, pretty, uh, pretty trustworthy. When did they stop having concerts last year? I think around March, all right, when, when everything was pretty much starting to be shut down and they pushed Coachella and blah, 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 blah. So like from, from then on, from March, April on, there was really nothing, which is kind of crazy. Oh, interesting, TJ. I didn't realize that. I wonder if that you think that's related to you think you think that's related to the top loader thing? Uh, those cards probably are already top loaded, so maybe not. All right. Next two boxes are already in the store. If you want to. Keep chasing the latest rookie class. We have some uh, maybe basketball scores I can I can give you. I think we're just starting our day in basketball. I think my Lakers are playing fairly shortly. They're in. Yeah, they're in Brooklyn. They're, they're on a kind of a rough road trip without... Or they finally got Andre Drummond back, so that's pretty good. Raptors and Cavs just started. Raptors up 14-7 very early in the game. And my Lakers and Nets are the ABC game tonight at the 30-minute mark of the next hour, if you're watching live. Sixers at Thunder. Kings are in Utah. Rockets are in Golden State. The Wizards are in Phoenix. Pistons are in Portland. And let, that's it. It's kind of a small slate of games today. All right. Good luck to Blair, Brad, and Brian. The Bees. Bzzz. There's Giannis Red Wave for the Bucks. Blair. We got Damari Carroll and a Hornet. It's Vernon Carey Jr. I was excited for saying, then I realized Lamelo is a redemption. Rookie signatures Vernon Carey Jr. That's our first autograph for Blair and the Charlotte Hornets. Out of 175, Damari Carroll. Blair with Houston. Blair will have most of these cards. Sadiq Bay. There's Chris Dunn, Victor Oladipo to 299. Isaac Okoro. Baseball regional coverage. There's a Coro for Cleveland. Hmm, yeah, TJ. Maybe maybe they just got too big too quickly. Now they're trying to catch up.
Arnold and Willis will be glad to have Mr. Drummond back. I don't understand that reference, Mike Tower. There's Jaden McDaniel Silver and a Kawhi Leonard Silver as well. I know these retro, these Prism retro cards, especially if they're silver, have been going pretty well for a lot of players. Jaden McDaniels for the Timberwolves, Bucks for Giannis. So when these random team breaks, vet commons don't ship. Obviously, rookie cards will ship. And if it's a parallel, obviously a, a veteran, but a parallel, that will obviously ship. Um, veteran cards that do ship, though, there are a few. LeBron, Giannis, Zion, Luka, and John Morant will specifically will specifically ship. Oh, it's a different strokes reference. All right. Jade McDaniels. Their second year Zion right here. Jeremy Lamb, of course, will ship because that's silver. I'll go to Brian and the Pacers. This is Anthony Edwards. Nice. There you go, Blair. Nice Anthony Edwards, number one overall pick. Sorry, Mike. Yeah. That, that one went over my head. I think I've maybe seen two episodes, full episodes of Different Strokes my entire life. It's Evan Fournier to 199. And Donovan Mitchell autograph for the Jazz, Blair. Maybe I was too busy watching uh, Lappin. Radio dramas were more were more my generation. Listening to old radio dramas. There's Thomas Sadaransky, two ninety nine, like uh, like the shadow. That's more my generation. <laughs> um, that one sheriff in the Yukon. Yeah, that's a banger. We got Elijah Hughes, Red Wave, from downtown, LeBron James. Jabari Parker, Brandon Ingram. There's Luka Doncic, third year Luka Doncic. That's right, Burge, only the shadow knows. Yeah, that's more my speed. There's Precious Achua. Purple. Yeah, the shadow is pretty good. Green Hornet. Green Hornet on the radio. Old radio drama. You always got to go tune in for that. About uh, another good radio drama, Orson Welles and the Third Man. Remember that one? That was a great one. Yeah, that was a good Precious to chew. That that's that's for Blair and the Heat. If you're rooting for the underdog, folks, Brad has the Warriors. We need to find him some Wiseman. Brian has the Pacers. I think we got that Jeremy Lamb for him. And the Wizards. Maybe some Denny Avijas. Brad also has... Brad must have a... Oh, yeah. There's Brad's second team with Atlanta Hawks. So let's try to find something for... Let's try to find something for everybody. At this point, which player should make the all-rookie team? Yeah, Lamelo should make that team. I I wonder if the injury might kind of keep him out. Is possible, but Lamelo should be in there. No, I think I think Lamelo's card still selling strong. 
in spite of that injury. Maybe not as strong as it could be if he was healthy, but for, for what it's worth, it's still going pretty well in the secondary market. And Charlotte has slipped a little bit as a team without LaMelo. He's definitely a big piece of their offense. But all, all rookie team? There's Bogdan Bogdanovich to 60. There you go. That'll be for Sacramento. Blair. And, and here's something for Brad. Sensational signatures, John Collins. He's been playing pretty well. <laughs> you know, Sean brought that up. Sean Jaspi brought that up the other night. The Lamelo and Zion on the list of top 10 under 25. And I was just like, I, I poo-pooed it. I was like, come on. That's just, that's just ESPN trying to clickbait people into arguing about lists. I was like, I refuse to fall into that trap. There's Vernon Carey Red Wave for Charlotte. That's what they want you to do, Mike Tower. They want you to talk about it by doing some crazy... Remember when NFL Network did their own top 100 or whatever? That was kind of weird, too. Zeke Naji Silver. I would think that Lamelo's and Tyrese Halliburton's got to be in the mix. Maybe Emmanuel Quickly, Obi Toppin's teammate, might could make the all rookie team. Anthony Edwards for sure will make that team. Here's Damian Lillard to 125. There's a nice LeBron James right here. That'll be for Blair and my Lakers. I did not, Rex. I, there was a family golfing in South Carolina, Rex is saying, is reporting, that had a ball land right on the back of an alligator. It stayed there and the ball never fell off. Yeah, you got to, Bert and Robert are right. You got to play, play it as it lies. What if that happened in like the Masters? Like an alligator crawls out from somewhere. There's Cole Anthony, Red Wave for the Magic. We got Precious Achua, Purple Ice. We got a regular purple and now a purple ice to 175. Blair in the Heat. And the autograph is going to be for Denver. That's going to be R.J. Hampton. Nice autograph for Blair. There's Emmanuel quickly. He's been having a pretty good season. There's a Giannis. And there's a Quickly's teammate, Obi Toppin. Nice hyper parallel. And their teammate, Julius Randle, has been having an incredible season. All these are for Blair and the Knicks. I think Julius Randle had another triple double yesterday. He's playing pretty well. He's racking him up. Almost like a, like a Draymond Green type machine. Siakam, Tyus Jones, Red to 299, Luca, Iverson, Teague, and Montrez Clippers edition right there. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Two box, uh, random team break number 19 in the book. We just scratched the surface of a uh, we just scratched the surface of a fresh case. So let's keep going. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the night. Yeah, Luis, I th I think Randall could be most improved player of the year. Something to look out for during awards season.
All right, I'll see you next time for the next one, jazbeescasebreaks.com.